M0 FXB ICOM 5100. If you want to add a Bluetooth unit, take a look at my one. So undo the screws here and here, here and here, and then two on the side, both sides. It is quite st stiff. I would lift from the back where the fan is. I mean, it's like really stiff. The other side, I tried to get the other side. I couldn't even get the other side off. Luckily, the side that has got the Bluetooth unit is the underneath where the serial number is. So the unit's here. They're about £50. You might be able to get one a bit cheaper if you shop around. So they sort of slip in underneath the plastic section there. So undo the screw here. So my finger is. Just whip that off. Now the reason I'm taking it off is because I want to use it on my 2730 with the black screen. And I'll probably, you know, swap it back. But, you know, if, I don't know if you've seen this one, but it's it's the 2730 and it has a black screen. And you can use the same module. It is a bit nervy when you're near components, but this just sort of holds it in place. Like so. And then just up, clip it up, it slots into that groove there. And so there's the actual unit. There's not much to it for £50, is there? Anyway, so we'll put the lid back on, and then we'll, uh, in another video, we'll uh, do the 2730. But just when you want, if you want to put it back in, you just go in into the groove line it up correctly you can see the little groove here and then line it up like so and then just gently sorry you couldn't see me doing it then could you up and then keep this quite hard to keep this steady there you go, and then put your bracket back on, and you're good to go. Thanks for watching, bye for now.